In the icy waters of the Arctic and North Pacific, there's a marine giant with an appetite to match its size. Meet the walrus, a true king of the Arctic seas. Hey there, ocean enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into the chilly waters of the walrus's world to discover what's on the menu for these tusked titans. Walruses are not picky eaters, but they do have their favorites. Their diet is primarily benthic, meaning they love to dine on the ocean floor's delicacies. Imagine a buffet spread across the seabed. For walruses, it's mostly about clams, snails, and mollusks. They use their powerful whiskers, called vibrissae, to detect their prey in the murky depths. But that's not all. These marine mammals also have a taste for shrimp, crabs, tube worms, and even soft corals. They're the gourmets of the Arctic, with a diet as varied as the ocean's bounty. As the seasons turn, the walrus's menu changes. During the summer, when the ice retreats, they follow their food to shallower waters. But come winter, they must venture deeper, braving the cold, dark waters to fill their bellies. Walruses are like the detectives of the ocean floor, always on the hunt for a good meal. Their method, a fascinating combination of suction and sensitivity. Those bristly whiskers aren't just for show. They're packed with over 10,000 nerve endings, making them super sensitive to the slightest movements on the ocean floor. Each sweep of their snout is like a radar scan, detecting clams and mollusks buried in the sediment. Once they've found their target, they pucker up and suck the soft prey right out of its shell. But how do these hefty creatures manage to dive so well? Walruses can hold their breath for up to 30 minutes and dive to depths of over 90 meters. That's like tumbling down a 30-story building, all in a day's work for a walrus. And let's not forget about those impressive tusks. They're not just for show or battling for dominance. They're essential tools for survival. When foraging, tusks come in handy for stirring up the seabed but they're also perfect for hauling their massive bodies up onto the ice. And in the wild, you never know when you'll need to defend your dinner. Those tusks are formidable weapons against any would-be meal thieves. It's not all about brute force, though. Walruses are also gentle and protective, using their tusks to cradle and guide their young, ensuring the next generation learns the art of foraging. If you're enjoying this deep dive into the life of walruses, show us some love with a like. Share this video with your fellow ocean lovers. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below. As we continue our journey with the walruses, let's delve into how their unique diet shapes their lives in profound ways. The rich diet of a walrus is more than just a daily routine. It's a building block for their impressive bulk. These animals can weigh up to 1,500 kilograms, and it's all thanks to the high-energy meals they consume. Packed with protein and nutrients, the clams and mollusks they feast on are not just delicious, they're essential. This diet fuels their growth, maintains their thick blubber, and supports their overall health, allowing them to thrive in the harsh Arctic environment But dining for walruses isn't just about sustenance. It's a social affair. These creatures often feed in groups, which helps protect them from predators and allows the younger walruses to learn from the adults. The social structure of walrus herds is complex and fascinating. By foraging together, they strengthen social bonds and ensure that even the youngest members know the ropes of finding the best feeding grounds. And here's a remarkable fact. Walruses have the ability to slow their heartbeat to conserve oxygen, allowing them to stay underwater for longer periods while they hunt. This adaptation is crucial for their survival and is a testament to their incredible evolutionary journey. Every dive is a calculated risk, but with their biological toolkit, 
Walruses are well equipped for the challenge. Their diet is not just food, it's the fuel for their extraordinary adaptations. So there you have it, folks. The walrus diet is a cornerstone of their existence, influencing everything from their size to their social interactions and even their physiology. Our Arctic adventurers face a sea of challenges that threaten their way of life and their very survival. Climate change is reshaping the Arctic at an alarming rate. As ice caps melt and sea levels rise, the walrus's dining room is literally disappearing beneath them. With less ice to rest on, walruses are forced to swim longer distances to reach their feeding grounds, expending precious energy they can scarcely afford to lose. But it's not just their environment that's changing. As the icy barriers between species melt away, walruses find themselves facing new competitors. Greenland sharks, seals and even polar bears can become rivals in the quest for food, leading to fierce competition under the waves. And let's not forget the impact of human activity. Overfishing can deplete the walrus's prey, while shipping lanes and oil exploration add noise and pollution further disrupting their habitat. The walrus's ability to find and catch food is being tested like never before. It's a race against time and a battle for resources in an ocean that's changing day by day. The challenges are daunting but not insurmountable. By understanding the hurdles walruses face, we can take action to ensure these magnificent creatures don't just survive but thrive. Join the cause to protect the Arctic and its inhabitants. Support conservation efforts. Be mindful of our environmental impact. And together, we can make a difference. As we've journeyed with the walruses, we've seen the wonders of their world. But now, we must face the harsh truth of the challenges they encounter in the wild. The Arctic is warming twice as fast as the rest of the planet, causing ice caps to melt at an unprecedented rate. This isn't just about losing a place to rest, it's about losing the very platform from which walruses hunt. As their icy hunting grounds recede, walruses are pushed to forage in less familiar, often less abundant, waters. The distances they must travel between the ice and food can be vast and exhausting, but the open water brings more than just fatigue. It brings competition. Orcas and larger seals, once separated by walls of ice, now encroach on the walrus's feeding territories, competing for the same shellfish and fish. And the competition isn't just with other marine animals. Industrial fishing fleets trawl the ocean, scooping up massive quantities of fish. The nets don't discriminate, often capturing the very creatures that make up the walrus's diet. The intrusion of human activity doesn't end with fishing. The cacophony of noise from shipping lanes, oil rigs and seismic surveys can disorient walruses, disrupt their communication and even drive them away from rich feeding areas. The walrus's ability to adapt is being outpaced by the speed of these changes. But hope is not lost. Conservation areas, sustainable fishing practices and climate action can help mitigate these impacts. It's a critical time for the walrus and for us. The choices we make today will determine the future of these iconic creatures and the entire Arctic ecosystem. We all have a part to play. Support organizations working to protect the Arctic. Reduce your carbon footprint. Advocate for policies that protect our oceans. Together we can turn the tide for the walruses.